Hey, hi guys. My name is Vijayanth and I'm going to quickly walk you through on how you can connect your G Suite account with a smart reach. And trust me, we're going to do this in just three easy steps. In step one, we will go ahead and check with your IMAP settings in your G Suite account. In step two, we'll go ahead and uh, create an app-based password in your G Suite account. And in step three, we will input the password and connect your G Suite account with a smart reach. Just for reference, I'm going to use my G Suite account over here so I can give you a complete walkthrough on the instruction sets. So let's go ahead and quickly walk through with this tab one. So once you log in with your G Suite account, you need to click on settings over here and then click on see all settings. On the next screen, look for forwarding and pop IMAP tab. And under IMAP access, make sure that your IMAP is enabled. Here it's not, so I just click on enable IMAP scroll it down and click on save changes so that you can confirm the changes and that's it so let's go ahead and move for step two for step two just click on your profile icon at the right hand side top corner next click on your manage your google account on the next screen you need to look for security there we go the fourth tab under security scroll it down and look for our passwords one more thing guys make sure that your two-star verification is turned on because if it is turned off then you will not be able to see the app passwords over here I'm going to click on app passwords then it will ask me to enter my credentials so I'm going to play entering that next I'm going to click on other and enter the connection name and I'll be inputting smart reach there we go next I'm going to click on generate all right you see that we just got the 16 digit password and this would be our app based password for smart reach I just selected that copy and click on done. next in our final step I'm going to input this password within your smart reach account so I'm going to click on the smart reach over here so once you are in your smart reach app just quickly go to the settings under settings look for team settings under team settings look for email accounts and simply click on add an email account over here so since the, this is the first email account I'm going to enter in my smart reach app so you are seeing this window probably if you have already entered or if you're already using a few accounts you will see list of your all accounts so just don't get confused on it so I'm going to click on add an email account Next, I'm going to select G Suite account. Here, I'm going to click on the preferred method which says via app specified password. Okay, I'm going to enter the credentials. And do remember, guys, here we're going to enter the password which we just created in earlier step. So, when you are going to enter the password for your email account, and the first and the last name and then I'm going to scroll it down and click on test settings and save there we go success so it's all set now see it was so quick and uh, while following all these instructions if you are going to face any concerns or if you have any doubt you can still reach out to us on this chat window either it's me or one of my teammates will be there to answer your queries and concerns do let us know if you could be of any help further.